different types of uh, timers in here the all the timers having a different brand names this one is Hager, Schneider and uh, Legrand and ABB those are the things so all the timers having a 24 hours ring for rotating so here I'll show it for all the timers for generally all the timer having a some auxiliary supply that means uh, coil supply so here this is a this is a spindle for 24 hour rotating spindle the spindles after that in downside the teeth are up and downs we do the up and downs then the timing will be set at the teeth will be up or down suppose in here the round types the teeth are down that means the timer is on the teeth are off the timer is off so that's the thing we need to set here so this is for coil supply so this T terminal for uh, relays then this is also relay and first the two terminals are for coil supply this T three terminals for relay so all the timers are same like that only uh, after that all the timers having a uh, auto or manual switch this one is auto or manual switch that means the timer will be going to bypass so this is a knob will be auto or manual so that one is shown in there then this is for this is also rotating one so this is also for rotating so this is also rotating for horizontally that one is sorry vertically this these are the two terminals that rotating in vertically uh, this is side that means left and right teeth if you put a left side that one is switched on if you put a right side that one is switched off that's the thing will be we need to set the timing uh, now we are going to see the real time of how to we do the setting sign how to we make connection just a minute now uh, we see general connection of uh, 24 hours timer 24 hour timer so this 24 hour timer having a generally two coils that means auxiliary supply auxiliary supply the two coils will be available mostly this one for 230 voltage or some special timers having a 12 voltage DC like this so this is for uh, auxiliary supply of 24 hour timers then this timer having a three terminals this three terminals for relay first one is common second one is normally open and third one is normally closed these are the five terminals will be very important for the 24 hour timer setting and connections those are the things first of all we need to connect phase supply for common so we need to connect phase supply for common so this is for general thing after that if you ask for our requirement if we need for NO that means the timer going to on at the time of the switching actually supply available that means you need to take NOs on here so take for any application software so this one is that means any of application you, you need to switch on so you give the NO supply to that applications phase and neutral as usual we give for neutral on here so this uh, suppose we need to activate by by using conductor so we need for a1 and a2 on here so this conductor going to switch on for our application like a fan or ac or tube light like any one of like this so this is for basic general connections of 24 hour timer now we are going to see a real time timer how is it working 
different types of timer